The work of my team and I is centered around the developmental origins of health and disease. This is a very interdisciplinary subject, ranging all the way from psychology through to fundamental hardcore biology. Within our daily work, mentorship is particularly important. It allows the young scientists to build the skills they need for their future careers. It allows them to build also the connections between the different aspects of our subject. And finally, for them to have their questions answered. It allows the young scientists to build the confidence and the skills that they need for the future. It's important because it emphasizes as well individual growth beyond the simple transfer of professional skills. And I would even say that it goes further, providing a role model and the support that the future generation need. And finally, because the young scientists are the not so distant future, perhaps we can help them avoid some of the problems that we had in our early career. For me, mentoring moves away from the classical student-supervisor hierarchical power dynamic. Mentoring, finally, is something more like a guide. The aim is rather to provide guidance and assistance as well as new skills. In the end, it becomes more interpersonal and professional than simply hierarchical. One example with mentorship would be a current PhD student in the team. Mentorship, in addition to giving her the skills she needed to do her PhD, gave her the confidence, the self-assurance to be able to go out, get some money and bring in additional parts to her project and have a study stay in London. The special moments, it's when the students come back and tell me how the sometimes uncomfortable discussions, but the mentorship and the way we interacted helps them in their career to move on and gain, for example, fa faculty positions elsewhere. Science is about advancement through curiosity and courage.